Hello and welcome to Rose Play Season 7, Episode 6. As always, I'm your host, Orion Moon Rose, and today we escaped from Carver, our cabin, and we're trying to locate Pete, which of course I'm the only one smart enough to notice. Da 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 da! A blood Anyone trail! See Anyone see him? Look for the blood, you morons! Alright, so. This is looking real good. Oh boy. I don't think Pete made it. Oh my god. Ah! Oh, at least he put a bullet in his own head. W what happened? What the hell happened? He's been shot. He didn't have a gun. Wait, what? Who did this? That's right, he didn't. Son of a bitch. We need to go. So did he die by the He's zombie's gone. head and then shot in the head, or did he ask somebody He's to gone. shoot him? You gotta huh. get moving. Come on, man. This is my fault! I shouldn't have ran away the other way like a chicken. I'm so sorry, Uncle Daddy Pete. <laughs> Sad moment, though, in all honesty. I liked Pete. Tell me. Tell me how it happened. He saved my life. Well, that was... that was Pete. Yup. I'm sorry. Nick, come on. I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? Can do. Sure, you still want to come with us? Look, I know we got off to a rough start, and I can't make any promises it won't get rougher. Yeah, I'm with you guys. And I got nothing I'm better to do. Not everyone is. Well, they'll get there. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. You hope? Five days? It's gonna be okay, Beck. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. And so begins the walking dead. They walk and they're on their death. Oh, okay, we're just gonna skip the five days later. That works too. I guess nothing exciting at all happened during those five days. None of them even said a word. No bonding, no nothing. They were just all walking like that for five days. Jeez, no sleep would make me cranky, too. Of course they got sleep. See anything? I see a bridge. I've been walking for a damn week. Up. Got to find some shelter. I don't know which way to start, so we'll just, I guess, look up. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. That's Probably like can support us all. Night. Here, eat this back. There's a lift or something. Chairlift? It must be that ski resort. I've never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. <laughs> All right, well, we know a bridge is coming up. There's a little house by the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. Well, it's not little house on the prairie. I think that might have been the cabin. There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. Good. Maybe I should check out the rest of the bridge, bridge before... Saying that? No? We can't okay. We can't go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're gonna be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but look, we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm gonna sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? Well, I never said it was a good idea, but it's better than risking everyone at once. Alright. What's your plan? 
I can agree with that. Cross low and slow. Make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. Clementine should stay here. She's. She's what? She's just a little girl, Luke. She's a valuable little girl. I can do it. Yeah, does nobody see? remember the shed? No problem. <laughs> it's gonna be fine. Okay, we'll Still see you guys in ten minutes. Not just watch bitten. for light far side. I can go too. You stay with the group. I'm fine, Luke. Just I don't like this. Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? If something happens, Ooh. I'll cover you. Come on. Hey, uh, sorry about that. I just could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. They're just still on edge after the Carver thing. It's Are you scary. sure it's not he wants to hang himself with said shoelaces? Be following us. What's the most important thing in this world? What does everyone want? Uh, Even the gangs. You know, what do you think they're all after? Safety? Safety? Close. Listen, what's the one thing a guy would walk hundreds of miles to get back? Food? Food. Nope. Come on. Clem, it's family. It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. Okay, but Anyways, I would have said family first if I thought he was related to any of you guys. We've all made mistakes. Done things that we regret. It's not my place to talk about someone else's past, you know? I don't want to upset her. Me neither. Well, who does want to upset a pregnant lady? Oh, good. Hmm. How about I take the one without legs? Too much noise. There are only two. Let's take them. I like your style. <laughs> I'll take the big one. You get shorty. Wish we could use guns. We should be okay. I've got the big one. Hey, kid. Look, it's not like I don't know you have guts, but are you crazy? Yes. Maybe I am. Just stick with the plan, okay? I want the big one. The short one's too small. Not even a challenge. Okay, though. Looks like somebody already tried. Mm. Go ahead. Give it a good pull. That sounds come free. tasty. I've done this before, remember? In a shed. With st stuff bigger than that? Nice work. Ow. And what have we learned? Well, we've learned he doesn't like me to uh, get the big ones. He wants those for himself. Maybe he's compensating for something. Or maybe Clementine just likes the big ones. I don't know. How about you get the one stationary and I get the moving one? Let me have some fun here. Oh, they're, maybe they're all moving. Never mind. Let's just hack and slash. Or, you know, Brigade of Dead. Shit. Come on, Luke. You got a machete. Just start slicing and dicing. Show them what that um, fruit knife can do. Oh, that's a great start. I'm okay. I just, I'm stuck. I see this. To be fair, so's that one. Behind you. Oh shit. Okay, that's awesome. See, I can take care of the big ones, Luke. Shh. 
Shut up! Bad zombie dog! Oh god! I don't wanna fall! Well, now with my hammer. Super monkey balls. Okay, Clem, that's it. Keep up the moving yourself to danger. Well, thankfully you're small and athletic. Wow, she can move without falling into some sort of danger. I don't think it like that. Oh. Wow. You're all right, Luke. Wow. Well, now you're really okay, Luke. Unless you fall like an idiot. Next time, I want the big one. That was close. Thanks, Clem. You're welcome. Let's, Let's see, what was I? I took care of four walkers, and he wanted me to get the small one. I see how you are, Nick. Oh, wrong person. Luke, not Nick. You see him? I do. Yeah. Not limping. Looks alive. Just play it cool. And you do the talking. What? Why me? I don't want to get in a fight. You really think he chewed a little girl? Just don't make any sudden moves. Normally, no. In a zombie don't apocalypse? Um, and yes. Don't tell him anything. I'd shoot me. Well, that's a hell of a thing to say. <laughs> well, if it comes to that, I'll shoot him first. <gasps> With what? Do you have a gun? Oh, okay, you do. I love that. I'd shoot well, me. Wow, what a thing to who say. I am. I'm Clementine, and this is Luke. Clementine and Luke. Shoot me. Oh boy. Do, do I move? Is he move? Okay, he's moving. Huh. You don't look like assholes. Are you assholes? Sometimes. You anything, but you know how it is out here. You run into a lot of assholes. We're just people. This is true. Fair enough. You folks headed north like everyone else? Everyone else? I see at least one group a day move through here. They all look the same. It's like a great migration of the dazed and confused. Why huh. do you care where we're going? It's sort of my business, considering I live here. You live here? Yep. You're in my backyard. I gotta <laughs> say, you two look like shit. If you need food, I've got some canned stuff in that station back there. We've got more than well, just that's, us uh, two. Awful nice of you. What's the catch? No catch. I've got plenty. Yeah, I remember, right. he's not an a-hole. Thank you. Hey, no Apparently, problem. like the rest of the a-holes. Nice into friendly faces out here. Like I said, I've got food and supplies back in the station. And if you want. What? Zombie? What the fuck, man? What the hell is he doing? Oh my no, no, God! No, no, no. He's, he's with us. Nick! No! Put it down! Don't shoot! I said don't shoot. What part of don't shoot did you not understand, Nick? Was it the don't? Because obviously you shot. Did I hit him? Where is he? I told you not to shoot. Well, probably suffocating and drowning in the water right you now. Trouble. You were waving your arms. Why did you shoot? He pointed a gun at me. Damn you it, did it first. Not to shoot. Oh, I'm probably turning to a zombie right now. You gave me a clear shot. That shot rang out for miles. We gotta get off this bridge. Let's go.
Huh. Hmm. Who the fuck was that back there? I don't know. Look we never got a name. That asshole drew on me. He was about to shoot. Oh, was he? I'm telling you, man, he drew first. Well, that's not what it looked like to me. Was it Nick's fault? <laughs> what did you see, Clem? Was that guy going to shoot? Fuck you, Luke. You've been on my case the whole week. And why do you think that is, Nick? I don't know. It happened so fast. But you were right there. Either way. So I'm a little girl. Yeah, I can't I be didn't. Superman all Look, the time. I, I know Pete was close to you, Nick, but you can't don't fucking talk about him. You think he was with Carver? I don't know. I. No, I don't think so. But he fell over. He fell off the damn bridge. We have to yeah. be moving. I can't. I need a minute. Fine. Fell off the bridge with a gaping Luke, hole. Can I talk to you alone? Through his neck. Don't think he's coming back unless it's to try to gnaw at me. Hey, Clem, you got anything to eat? Beck's dying here. Alvin, I told you I'm fine. Sorry, I'm out. Wish we still had those juice boxes. Yeah, me too. That man said he had food in the station. Mind checking it out? Maybe we could spend the night here. A little small for us, though. Sure. Feel a little weird after Thanks, we technically just killed a man to do this, but again, Walking Dead, universe, blah, blah, blah. Alright, I guess we'll just go down the line of talking to people, then. See what we can learn. Besides food in there. Rebecca, are you okay? I'm alright. I just need a little rest. Oh, at least and you become like nicer to me cabin. since, you know, the cabin. Sarah has nothing to say to me. That's all right. I had to kill my mom. I heard. I'm sorry. <laughs> Sounds weird when I say it out loud, huh? In a non-zombie apocalypse, People yeah. Always used to push me. I never wanted to go into business with him. I remember when he sold me on it. His big plan. Some fucking plan. I think everybody's plans and dreams got screwed up in a zombie apocalypse. And that was that. After six months, we were flat broke. I didn't care. We were having fun. I wish I was like him. I wish I could just keep moving all the time. I'm just not built like that. I'm sure they're talking about me right now. Look, he's becoming a danger to the group. So who was that guy? I swear. It looked like he was holding you guys up. I figured he was with Carver. He could have been anybody. Right. We don't know. How do we know he wasn't with Carver anyway? If Alvin is in front of me, he takes that shot. What a fucking mess. Maybe I am losing it. I don't know anymore. God, I'm hungry. What time yeah, is I'll go anyway? get that food. Damn. Damn. What's wrong? I left my watch back at the cabin. It was Pete's. He gave it to me. That's all I had left of him. Oh, crap. You know now what? I feel bad. I'm going to go talk to them. Sh I didn't want to take the watch, but now I think I should have. Poop. Of course, if I would have took it, he might have thought I was a thief. Uh, Double-edged sword. All right, so. It's dead. Yeah, no crap, Sherlock. So he was telling the truth about that. There's empty cans. Hope that's not the food he was talking about. Food. There's got to be something left. Oh, a survival knife. Ooh. 
We're not going to take it. I have a bad feeling about the knife. I don't see a key around here. That man probably had it. Of course. I'm going to try one more time. Don't I still have the hammer on? Oh, yeah, I dropped the hammer, didn't I? Crap. I don't see a key around here. That man probably had All right, time to get the knife that I don't want to get. So did he get the knife signed by Walter Matthau? Huh. Wow, that's actually a pretty big knife. Dang. Well, now I'm mini Luke. Woohoo, canned food. Man. And I thought we had a bed. Look at this dump. Guess he no, did have of. food. Man, fuck Nick. Nick's lost a lot of his people, that's for sure. But that doesn't give him any excuse to start shooting up strangers. He was he trying, was to, trying help to help us. us. Yeah, and someone died. I ain't no judge, but that's straight up murder in my book. I mean, you ever know anyone to do a thing like that? Not before the zombie apocalypse. Actually, yeah. What happened? A woman in our group. Her dad died, and then she just shot this other woman. Damn. What'd you do? We left her behind. Damn. That's funny. She looks just like you. Um, except white. Hey, Clem, there's not a lot of food here, and Rebecca, well, she's eating for two. You think we can keep this just between us? I hate to even say it, you know, but... And I'd never go against the group. Rebecca can have it. I won't say anything. Thanks, Clementine. It's a shame. Nick was a good guy. He's still a good guy. He's just losing it. God knows we're not perfect. Hell, I'm glad you're with us, Clementine. <laughs> what the hell is that? Yeah, I do. I, I talk. I, I've been talking on and off through the episode. Just kind of a silent moment, Fog. Here. Yeah, we saw it. All right, we're heading up. All right. Let's see the dead following us. Yeah, I was going to say, Fog, I usually just have moments on and off of sometimes I'll joke, talk, and then I'm just quiet. Does that say Bookie's well, Trail? What are we waiting for? Are we in the Nightmare Before Christmas? Thank you, Fog. Careful. I appreciate been on the that. Road for five days. My back is done being careful. Well, you're pregnant. Of course you're done like being careful. Home. Wait, what? No, that don't even make sense. How are you done being careful? You're pregnant, woman. Be overprotective. I'll go with you. Well, she said she's well, done being careful. There. You're pregnant. I'm sorry. You should never be done being top. careful, especially yeah, in a zombie apocalypse. There. Feel like taking a look? Uh, It'd be just like climbing a treehouse. Yeah, I'm just a, a really tall treehouse. My zodiac fog is a Pisces. I hated it. Oh. Well, you only hated it because you were kind of stuck in it for a bit. Just take it slow, and I'll catch you if you fall. Probably. All right, well, if you don't catch me, I'm going to make sure I try to land on the first soft thing I find. Oh, it's you. Now that was fun. That sounds stupid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was. The trick was not to look down, though. Oh, you're fine, Fog. You can continue to talk if you want. I don't ever mind. I was talking about him not catching me. You're fine. Just look at me, okay? You're, you're fine. All right, just, just slow down. Just for a second, okay? I know I'm fine. Just trying to help. 
Well, you could help by not letting me have climbed this thing. Oh, look! I think the first animal I've seen that's alive in a while. And it just happens to be a bird. Made it! And I lost my only friend. Well, I guess that was the dog, but you can't consider him a friend after he, um... Oh, I don't know. I can see Bit the, the crap out of my arm. Wait, is that a car? Nah, it can't be a car. Wait, I see something. What is it? A light. But wait, there's another. Luke. Yeah, I know, right, Fog? Luke. Uh. Luke? Okay. So now I'm just going to fall on the ground, and you're going to feel bad. Listen, everyone, just stay calm. Who are you? Are you trying to rob us? Excuse me, honey, but do I look like a fucking thief? Everyone calm down. Hey, man, May you calm the fuck down. Be? Sarah, get behind just me. Just tell us who you are. We ain't here to rob nobody. Put the gun down, Fuck man. that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Please. Yeah, let's not have a repeat of the other guy on the bridge. Kenny? Kenny. Wait, you know this guy? Clementine? <laughs> They're all gonna die. Pretty much, it's the zombie apocalypse. There is no winner in it. I'll take that as a yes. Well, either that, or I'm very confused and disorientated. We can talk inside. Great. I just started dinner. Are you sure you don't mind? It's gonna storm soon. Please, come in. Any friend of Clementine is a friend of mine, zombie winner. At least until all the zombies uh, decay away, but by that point, humanity is probably long gone, too. And I'm either gonna guess we're close to Christmas time, or it was around Christmas Jenny time when the lodge became the inhabitable. Used to be a ski lodge, obviously, so we have plenty of food. And that's uh, good. Believe it or not, we still get some power from that wind turbine out front. I know, right? We tend to keep most. I guess the, the wind turbines really do do it, Fog. But after we found this stuff in storage, we couldn't resist making an exception. What's funny? Oh, nothing, Walt. Walter here's one smart some bitch. Makes a mean can of beans, too. Well, why don't Which is like the whole diet of the zombie the apocalypse. Please, beans, beans, and more beans. And if not beans, canned goods. The hell we will. Yeah, I'm holding on to my rifle. Thanks. You're our guest here. There's no need to worry. Tell him to put his gun down then. Kenny. Will you vouch for these people, Clamp? So far, yeah. You tell me they're good, then I'm good. us. You were the one waving a gun around, man. We're cool, okay? Hey, Nick. Hey, we're cool. We're cool. behave. They're cool. Dad, look, a Christmas tree. Not now, Sarah. Possibly not around Christmas Isn't time. Isn't it great? We found it all in storage. It's amazing. <laughs> no hope. That may be right, Fog. Of course, I want to know how the heck you made it all the way up here, Kenny, from a town that was infested with zombies.
Yeah, everybody's infected. That was uh, proven during the, um, I think, season two of The Still Walking Dead. This dirty old thing, huh? It's my favorite dirty you know, old I half thing. I expected to see Lee walk up next to you. You guys were like two peas in a pod. And besides that, I think I got uh, Lee's oh, blood shit, on the hat. I didn't mean to... Don't think it's I watched just that. Hard not to think about it, you know. He saved me. I knew it. I knew he would. That guy had a fire in him, sure as shit. <laughs> hell. He was a hell of a guy. Well, at least I made him into a hell of a guy. He took care of him. I'll never forget that. So, where'd you end up? Well, here, obviously. I was with Krista and Omid. Omid? Well... Krista and I were together for a while, but these guys caught us. She's gone. Not to be mistaken with these guys that are with me now. Sounds like it ain't been easy for you. I'm sorry, darling. I wish I could have found you sooner. Where have you been? Oh, hell. All over after Savannah. Well, apparently you made it up yeah, here. There. For some reason, I tried to save that fucking shitbird, Ben. Because you started to care. Cluster. Couldn't help the kid, but I got out. Long story short, I got lucky. Real lucky. Oh, well, yeah. Spoke There's no way you should have survived. That. It, uh... And then I met Sarita. Thank God. Gosh, it's great to have you back. It's great to see you, you too, Kenny. I, I've this is my actually Sarita. missed you. Ain't she beautiful? Nice to meet you, Clementine. Hey, Walt, where's Matt? Now the only survivor out around? of the original. Of course he Besides is. Clem. Well, I'll start dinner. Carlos, right? Mind if I steal your daughter for a secret mission? I Can actually do. Can we do anything to help? Could use a hand outside. We got a lot of supplies to bring in before that storm hits. Sure. I know, right? Clem, why don't you help Walt with dinner? Someone's cooking hey, dinner with Walt. Well Better not be yeah, me, cause thanks. I never Excellent. learn. Everything will burn, burn, bit? burn, burn, burn. Even the bean fog, they will burn. So how do you know Kenny? He and Sarita have been a huge help. Matthew and I barely knew what to do around here the first week. We're old friends. I yeah, met like I did say though, be or uh, bean. When he was with like him. I did say, fog. That's yeah, all it seems to be in this universe. Somewhere. Left is beans. Connecting with people is so important. I don't know what I'd do without Matthew. Gosh, you remind me of my students. I can't imagine what it's like growing up in the middle of all this. Not pretty, Walt. Not pretty. It hasn't been easy. I can imagine. It's hard enough as an adult. Hmm. Almost done. Would you do me the honor of tasting the first course, madam? As long as it doesn't um what kill me. Le Walter surprise. An autumnal legume salad with a peach roux. It's peaches and beans. That's all we got. Huh. huh. Striking resemblance. Oh god. Except she's white. Anyway, I'll take it from here. <laughs> Poison them. <laughs> I I definitely think my cooking would probably be the thing that would do that first. Yes, he did indeed say peaches, Fog. All right, I think I'm going to go ahead and leave it there for the day. Uh, thank you all for joining me as always. Uh, special thanks to you, Fog, for joining me and conversing with me in today's episode. If you are interested in past episodes and other things I have done, you can also check me out on YouTube. Uh, just type in Orion Moon Rose. 
there was a few other people before you. They they come and go. But yeah, it's been you for a bit. <laughs> but um, feel free to check me out on YouTube under Orion Moonrose. Uh, it's where I put all the recordings from Twitch when I'm done. And for the rest of you, uh, come back next time where we will eat peaches and beans, possibly die from it. I don't do this daily. Um, I do it at least three times a week, though. Um, I got like 130-something episodes. Not of just The Walking Dead. I've done uh, Season 1, Season 2, uh, and a few other games. And then I've also done a few movie game reviews, rants, so on and so forth. It's a little bit more than just this sometimes. But it's the bulk of the show. Um, it's called Rose Play. <laughs> Which, of course, as y'all on YouTube right now are seeing, yes. I'm talking in meta about the show. Uh, so peaches and beans, die from it, and hopefully me and Kenny go trotting off to find Krista so we can form an old group. So, until next time, remember, keep gaming, never give up, and I'd shoot me too. Goodbye, Fog. Nice talking to you.